hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to quickly show you this hair i installed this hair last week i wanted to give it time to see how it comes out before i come and just like edit the video and set it out so if you are watching this video you have not liked this video yet please click the like button i really like it when you guys like my video if you want to know how i achieved this look and where i got the hair from then just keep watching Alright, so the hair I'm using today is from AliExpress and it's a Fort Lux. This Fort Lux is, um, has a um, colored line on it, like a wool that they use to wrap it around. That is what it looks like on the website. And so you can check the website to see um, the one you want. I got seven packs, but I use four and a half at the end of the day. And I got color 1B. So this is what it looks like. is a jumbo Fort Lux. Which is really nice. I think I have like 12 in a bundle. And so because of the size, the hair gets full quickly. So I use four and a half. So now we are going on to the braid pattern. I'm going to keep it simple. I'm doing individual braids in the front and I'm doing the normal usual cornrow at the back. So I'll let you watch what I'm doing and I'll talk to you soon. Alright, so this is what it should look like if you are doing the individual crochet in the front. I just separated my hair like so because it's a jumbo for looks. I just didn't want to do it tiny. And so I went with this size. And um, yeah, I just braided my own hair like so. And I actually like this look on me, guys. What do you think? Uh, this should be a style I should wear. Like I should try this out. After all, it's a protective style. I really like... It, I just like the look of this on me. I know I've done like um, twists on my hair before, but you know, doing this braid on the stretched hair, I like, oh, this looks really nice. I'm gonna try this very soon, guys. What do you think? Just comment down in the comment section. Now that my whole braid pattern is completed, I'm going to go ahead now and start installing these um, fault locks. So I'm um, starting from the back. So I put the front um, in a bun. So yeah, this is the hole that it, it came with. So I just put it like this and I make sure that I loop it and I open it up. You have to be careful when you're opening it because this hair 
has a tendency of unraveling like it will just unravel on you like guys so yeah you have to be really careful so you know because the normal usual crochet braid is a normal thing that we do at the back everybody knows how to do that i went straight to the front to show you what i was doing so what i'm doing is to just crochet the hair on on the root of my own braid then when i make sure that i have you know secured the hair and i have looped it so i'm going to go ahead and put my own natural hair inside of the um hair i crocheted so it's very easy just watch it to see what i'm doing So now that I've finished adding the hair in the front, I'm going to add more hair. This is optional. If you feel that you need to add more hair to make it look, uh, you know, more, you can add more hair on the root. This is just like the individual crochet. And yeah, and guys, I didn't even know what to do with the rope that was hanging, whether I should cut it off or not. But I think cutting it off was a better idea. And like I said before, this is a 12 inches. I would have preferred this to be a 10 inches. I like this size and everything, but I wish it was a little bit shorter, just like below my chin, you know, to have that bob look. But and, and, and it's not recommendable to cut this hair because I know the everything will just begin to open up. So guys, what do you think about this install? Did I nail it? Do you like it? Is this something that you want to wear? Don't forget to check the description box for the information and the link to buy this hair. Don't forget to like this video, don't forget to share and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, so thanks so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like it. And yes, until my next one. Bye.